watching WGALA. Now, coverage you can count on continues. From the home of Super Doppler 8, this is News 8 at 6. Could make the difference in someone's life. Fire trucks going high tech with onboard computers. Getting to a call is about to get a whole lot easier. It is tonight's top story. Good evening. I'm Janelle Stelson. Kim and Ron are off. Several fire companies in Lancaster County are now equipped with laptop computers to direct them to fire scenes. News 8's Lancaster County reporter Carrie Fairchild has this story you will only see here on News 8. Inside this fire truck, the latest technology to help firefighters get right to your doorstep. They type in the house number first. And within seconds, a map showing fire crews where to go. It highlights the house in, in yellow. It also highlights the streets so they can see which street it's on. The blue squares are the fire hydrants. Before now, firefighters relied on huge binders filled with paper maps, a time-consuming process. Most of the residential neighborhoods were divided into two, three, sometimes four different map pages. Now with a few clicks, it's all in front of them. It is allowing us to see more fire hydrants, more landmarks than we were able to see off of the paper map. And once firefighters get to the scene with just the click of a button, this laptop transforms into a tablet that they can take right with them. The portable computer also gives them information they didn't have before, like detailed floor plans of factories and schools. So if there's, let's say, a fire in the kitchen, they can just click on the kitchen and see where that is in the building. Eden Fire Company already has two computers and plans to buy two more. Overall, it will greatly increase our effectiveness. The software called OnScene Explorer was developed by Lancaster native John Fix. Each computer costs about $7,000. So far, four fire companies have bought it. I expect that someday a chief's going to call me up and tell me that somebody's life was saved because they knew the information ahead of time. In Lancaster County, Carrie Fairchild, News 8. The company Iron Compass wants to develop the software to eventually track firefighters when they go inside burning buildings.